I mean, at this point, it's like, who haven't you secondhand slept with? So this week, I'm going to talk about the ghost. Yay! Or should I say hi? <laughs> but seriously, gay people are kind of whores. No offense. But like... If you just go through who slept with who, slept with who, slept with who, then basically you slept with everybody, especially in like your one area. Like say, I slept with this person, and this person slept with this person, this person slept with this person. And then at the end of the chain, it's like I slept with Perez Hilton, who has a baby now, so I... <laughs> Sorry for that, baby. Yeah, and also I just feel like <clears throat> you know, grinder and scruff are can be good social media networks. Like I've met all my close friends from grinder basically for the most part and I've not slept with them. I have not slept with them just saying throwing that out there cuz I'm not a whore at all. I'm a classy bitch with a yeah, but I feel like it's making us all antisocial. Like, people are out at the bar, and they're, like, over on fucking Grinder, like, I see you across the room. Instead of going up to that person across the room and being like, hey, let me buy you a drink, whoa, whoa. I'm over the bar, bar, bar. Like, I don't understand, like, it's like, People will also just stay at home instead of going out and meeting normal human beings like normal people on these apps. Like, it's just stupid. Like, let's go meet people old-fashioned ways. And, like, like my friends who got married, they met at a party. You know? Like, normal human beings meet at parties. But no, our generation's all fucked. And then when we go out to clubs, and by us, I mean... The gays, not me, because I go out and I just, I'll go out alone and just have a blast. Like, I feel like everyone just stays in their one little circle. Like, this is a circle. All right, I'll use Egbert. I just want him today. His name's Egbert because he's a fucking egg and he's a fucking bird. I want him in a fucking, did I want him at Red Robins and they took 20 minutes before they even Asked what our order was, and at that point, we already ordered our fucking appetizer, sandwich, dessert, and everything. And it was Brandon's birthday, like, bitch, it's his birthday, you should be out here on time and shit. But anyways, we all just sit and stand in the circle, all the homos. And we don't socialize with anyone outside of the circle. So what I feel like is that we need to stop that and go talk to that 70-year-old across the room. Just cause, just see what he's like. I'm pretty sure you could do the eight degrees of separation. You probably slept with his son or something, you know? Just get outside of our circle and like socialize. And by us, I mean other people. I'm just saying. And in other news, I probably slept with fucking A-Rod at this point. And that's all I gotta say, so. Gay people just stick with fashion and try and meet new people. And go outside your comfort zone instead of just sticking to the norm. Go talk to a giant bear. Hmm. That's all I gotta say. Okay, bye.